Tonight, we begin with our top local story in Warwick, where fire has driven a family from their home. Flames broke out in a home on Samuel Gorton Avenue in Warwick around 6.30 p.m. Highway to Sue's reporter Steve Nielsen has been on the scene all evening long, and he joins us now live from the West Bay Mobile Newsroom with our top local story tonight. A father and his two kids are out of a home tonight, which is all stuff for a family, especially this time of year, but we're told this fire could have been a lot worse. Firefighters gut a Warwick house after a blaze tears through the second story. The damage evident in both windows. No one was inside when the fire started, but a father and his two young children call this place their home. Confirmed that everyone was out. Uh, they went in, uh, knocked the fire down, and we had the fire under control. It took crews only about 15 minutes to do that, but the damage from the flames will long be felt. Now being pulled out of the upstairs bedroom, charred memories. We've had far too many of these this year around the holidays and so we've got another family that's out of a house. Although a cause of the fire hasn't been determined, officials say this time of year when everyone starts cranking heaters and freezing temperatures, there are things homeowners should avoid. The auxiliary heaters, those, those uh, little electric heaters and so on, um, follow the manufacturer's guidelines and so on to, you know, keep them away from, uh, you know, products that are inside the house. Tips that could help prevent this from happening to more families in southern New England this winter. Now, fire crews tell us they did have a problem with one of the fire hydrants when they arrived on scene, but that it didn't affect their ability to put the blaze out. Live in Warwick with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom, I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.